Deep breaths, deep breaths. I have been waiting for this day for probably over a year now. I don't really know when the Steam Deck was announced and when the pre-orders and, you know, the reservations came out, but it feels like it's been 10 years, but it's probably only been a year and I'm so freaking excited. Like, I can feel my blood pressure. I can feel my veins. Calm down. Calm down, this is fine, it's fine. What's up gamers and friends, welcome back for some excited vibes, dude. I, you have no idea, I'm so sorry. It's a combination of the situation right now and coffee. There's a few days that I can think of in my short gamer life that has been such a milestone to my gaming existence. First thing that comes to mind is the day I realized you could play with other people across the world on an Xbox 360 playing Halo 3. That was a really exciting day. And finally getting my own Xbox 360. That was like one of the greatest days of my life as well. Discovering Skyrim and Oblivion and Elder Scrolls and the Fallout games for the first time. That was kind of a big deal for me. Starting my own gaming channel on the internet. That was also a huge one. And now fast forwarding to today, I am going to be unboxing. I don't want to sh dox myself here. The Steam Deck that I had to wait for an entire year. I'm so excited to finally have something that allows me to play PC games from the comfort of my own bed. Just letting you know right now, after today, you may or may not see me ever again. All right, anyway, I know why you're here. You just wanna see the toy. I feel like a kid on Christmas. You have no idea. I have my weapon of choice. I'm about to stab away, all right? right, let's let's get right into it. Yeah, I'm really, not wanting to dox myself here. At least their packaging is near impossible to get into. At least you know the thing is safe. Oh my god. Definitely should mention, I did not receive this for free. There is absolutely no sponsorship going along with this video or this unboxing. I quite literally blew a hole in my wallet for the sake of this because to me, you know what? Yes, it was a massive purchase. No, I don't regret it. Money's meant to be spent. You can't take it with you when you go. So I figured, you know, life's too short to not treat yourself. But this is completely paid for by myself. RIP bank account. All right, let's get back into it. Uh, let's just yank it out here. Oh my goodness. I knew it. I knew there was something at the end here. Okay, yes, it is the power adapter. All right. Awesome, I'm so glad I just accidentally chucked that halfway across the room. Good job, Miranda. Oh my god. Dude, that's so fun. Valve, don't mean to dox you, but it's fine. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't. Is this real? Is this real? This isn't real life, is it? Like, I, a year. I've been waiting for this moment all year. I think this is like one of the only things I've been able to talk about since the beginning of 2022. I just, I, I kept complaining about how badly I just want to play games from bed. But like PC games. There's so many PC games that I, ow, that I want to play. But I'm frankly too lazy to just sit down at my PC. Like, I don't know how to explain it. Frankly, there is no explanation for that level of laziness. It's just embarrassing. Oh, I think I bought the edition that came with the case. I was like, kind of sweet that this comes with the case. I should also mention that I got the middle of the road model. I think it was like $520. Um, but it's the 256 gigabyte model. Um, I figured that's enough for me to download several games and then I can always add more extra storage if I want to. <laughs> it's beautiful. I can see myself. This is some inception level crap. Look at that. Look at that. Yo, I need a case. Oh, I'm, am I holding it upside down? I am holding it upside down. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna cry. Stop. Don't make fun of me. Okay. I get really emotional. I love video games so much. I don't even know what I'm going to download on it first. I think I want to download Elden Ring. I'm probably going to download No Man's Sky. That's been a game that is super chill and I've been wanting to get back into for a long time, but it's it seems like it's very time consuming, but now I can play it from bed. It's got these like super awesome 
like finger pad things. I'm excited to like check that out and see if that's even something I'll be using, but I'm definitely gonna use more of the joy joysticks. You got the num you got the not the number pads, you got the buttons, the the buttons, and you got the D-pad, and oh my gosh, can I turn it on? Okay, can I can turn it on. It probably needs a charge, which makes complete sense. I was wanting to see if I could turn it on for you guys so you can actually see what it looks like with the screen on. But now I'm going to open the power adapter without breaking a nail. I'm going to tear something, and it's going to be more than a box, and it's going to be in my body somewhere, so that'll be fun. This is probably the most violent unboxing you've ever seen. I apologize, but, you know... I can't hide my level of excitement. You yeah, probably need this booklet. For people like me, we need to read stuff. Okay, so we got the power adapter, a good USB-C cord. Love these. Um, I hope it's long enough. I hope it's long enough for me to actually be able to charge it while playing it in bed. I think I'll be fine, though. Oh, my God. I can't believe how sleek it looks. I definitely wanted enough storage to be able to download at least a couple games that I play pretty regularly. I can't wait to play Stardew Valley. Oh, I just realized. Oh my, oh my gosh, there's actually more buttons. There's like four more buttons on the back here. Uh, L4, L5, and R4. R5 is going to be a dream with the mutton, mutton bapping. Button mapping. I've been doing this far too, far too much. I need to just kind of chill and like think before I speak. Guys, I hate to sound like a broken record, but I am so grateful for this thing. I'm so happy that it finally came and I was so excited when I got the email. I got the email a couple days ago that my Steam Deck was ready to ship. And it was nice that they gave me a couple days to really think about it um, before I put in the order. I literally only thought about it for a day, but like inside, deep down inside, it was just something that I've been wanting for a long time. And like I said, life's too short to not treat yourself. If you have the money and it's something that you really, really want to treat yourself with, why not? And again, like I'm so grateful that they sent it to me and that I got the opportunity to purchase it and the fact that it got to me a day, a whole day earlier than the tracking information said it was going to be here. It was like a mini surprise when I got home from a really, really long day. Thank you guys so much for watching this unboxing video of the Steam Deck, the again 256 gigabyte model. I'm going to be trying this out, obviously, very, very soon, probably tonight. I'm going to charge it up, figure it out. I don't really know what to expect when I boot it up. I've heard it's kind of like a mini PC. You don't have to only play Steam games. I think you can download really any launcher that you want. But yeah, I don't know how the performance of the games are going to be. Um, I've heard really good things about it so far, but I'm just excited to try it out for myself. I'm hoping to down the road after I've given it enough time and I have enough experience with this little toy to be able to make a potential review video, first impressions, pros and cons, and just my overall thoughts on the Steam Deck. If you're looking forward to seeing like a follow-up video on this and just my general thoughts on it from somebody who's, let me be clear, not a tech expert, I just really like toys and video games. Video game toys, consoles, PCs, everything. I love it all. If you guys are looking forward to a follow-up video on this after I've given it enough time playing with it, definitely make sure to like and subscribe to this channel and click that bell button to get notified when I upload that review. I literally cannot wait to play this tonight. I'm going to totally not be gushing about this for weeks, months, probably even the next year. But now, since I got really lucky with this baby, I'm hoping to get lucky with the PlayStation 5, y'all. Ooh, 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 complete that console collection. But this will be taking up a good majority of my time. So I'm just, I'm just so excited to play this. You have no idea. I don't even know what I want to download on it first. I want to download it all. I want to play all the games. I'm never going to leave my bed ever again. It's nice knowing you guys. It's been a fun 
ride. It's been real. See you guys in like 2045. Anyway, all jokes aside, thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed this little unboxing video. These are really fun to make. I love making videos outside of just gameplay and overall like gaming content. Tech is a fun, fun genre. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Make sure to treat yourselves. You know, it's so important to treat yourselves. Even if it's just a little thing, even if it's just buying yourself a coffee, buying yourself that new console that you've been wanting, like why not? Do it, you deserve it. You owe it to yourself to make yourself as happy as you possibly can. And if that's something simple like buying yourself a little gadget, why not do it? I hope again you have a great rest of your day and I'll see you guys next time.